South Korea's President Moon Jae-in will be in Delhi on his first visit on Sunday. His visit comes just a month after the Trump-Kim summit in Singapore. A look at the high points of the visit and what is at stake. Vion's principal diplomatic correspondent, Sidhan Sibyl, reports. Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi will get an update on the situation in the Korean Peninsula when South Korea's President Moon Jae-in lands in Delhi on Sunday. As one of the few countries with a functioning embassy in North Korea, South Korean diplomats believe India has a positive role to play. Well, I think this engagement is very much positive. As you said, uh, the more communication, the more encounter with North Korea can help North Korea rethink uh, their path mm. and uh, rethink about their future. Mm. So India's uh, uh, role in sending right message uh, in engaging uh, North Korea is uh, quite uh, uh, positive, I believe. Recently, India had sent General V.K. Singh, Minister of State for External Affairs, to Pyongyang with a message for the North Korean leader. India has also upgraded its diplomatic presence there with the dispatch of an ambassador. The India is a great country. It's not just an ordinary country. So India's presence in Pyongyang itself is very important and uh, uh, it has, uh, you have a leverage, whatever kind of you see. You say then it cannot but influence uh, North Korean government. So I think uh, it's important that uh, uh, you maintain leverage and I hope that you can contribute uh, constructively in the in the Korean Peninsula issues. Narendra Modi and President Moon will share perspectives on each other's region. Both have common concerns about the challenge posed by the rise of China, but Seoul is beholden to Beijing for the role it played in keeping North Korea in check. Add to that the billions of dollars in bilateral trade and more than 3 million Chinese tourists who come to South Korea every year. As a bigger country, India can still afford to look China in the eye and refuse to be a part of the Belt and Road Initiative. Modi is also expected to seek Moon's views on Islamabad Pyongyang's strategic nexus and the nuclear black market of Pakistani scientist A.Q. Khan, which was shut down in 2004. Beyond that, this visit is about pushing forward the delhi seoul economic partnership. Defence is another area of focus. India is buying and building the K-9 self-propelled gun from South Korea. A deal for minesweepers for the Indian Navy had to be cancelled, although there are indications it could be reopened. India and South Korea have special strategic partnership. Relationship with South Korea is a logical extension of India's Act East policy. South Korea has its own southern strategy. There's a convergence and this convergence matters at a time when global political order is going through a change. With video journalist Jinu Siddhan Sibbal for Vion in New Delhi.